Hello, ghost in good day, brother, brother ghost. Are you the Holy Ghost? How we doing? Let's get you all set up, sitting over there. What do we have today? Welcome to BBC Woman's Hour book. Look at this for an old tatter. Don't worry, I'm not reading it, but uh, <coughs> inscriptions. The Woman's Hour book, the BBC, published by arrangement, <laughs> the BBC's Woman's Hour programme has been described as the largest club for women in the country, or indeed in any country. For daily at two o'clock, housewives everywhere of all sorts and conditions settle down to listen, to learn, to enjoy talks and discussions on every possible subject, connected both with their homes and with the wider world. To Darling Mummy, with lots of love, from Julie, Christmas 1957. Oh my goodness, it's that ancient, it's fell apart in my hands. Things like this happen to me. I get given things and uh, they fall apart. So um, pretty much like what I'm doing here, casting, um, we'll have an hour, a catch up. The greatest story never told is not going to come, um, unfortunately <laughs> for me. Um, so easily from the BBC Woman Hour book. The greatest story never told is about the greatest story that has been told. Um, good day, salutations to one and all, four in the house, one thumbs up, Michael, hello, I'll contact you later my good man, I am in the house today as you can see. Tomorrow I'm in the house, a couple of days out of um, servitude. So you have my pleasure, we'll have some updates, I've posted it in a dot com, let them know we are live, so say hello, introduce yourself, and um, I will proceed. If you haven't seen the videos uh, uploaded recently to Indiglow, I would encourage you to check out um, brother, brother, Jordan Maxwell, and uh, the interview with Zachariah Sitchin, um, you'll see a thin Jordan in a black uh, suit, um, 40 minutes, um, rare footage I'd say, um, two intellectual minds there, um, disregard the clubs that they were in, listen to the content, what they are saying, what they are talking about, um, and also Brother Santos and his astro-theological connections. Um, if you are uh, classifying yourself as uh, someone who is a Christian, um, which derivative or denomination of the Christian faith are you in? Um, upon my last recollection and um, confirmation with Santos research and discovery, there are currently about 30,000 denominations for the Christian um, faith there. So, um, you know, one of them may be a true faith, well, religion as it is. I'm at ease here. Don't hold me to my words. Um, very interesting to say the least yes yeah? so um the greatest story never told would you say how many have we got eight eight i need all of you to answer here please this is an interactive cast fortunately for you would you who of the eight viewers now believes the bible is a true record of events or would you argue or believe that the bible is in fact a story the greatest story ever told um, I'm not going into chapter and verse here, but we will reference um, later in the video the reasons for this, what exactly the names, places. Um, I'll go with Nubian Empire. What's made it click for me is finding the uh, Osiris, Isis, Horus, um, the sun um, being measured in the sky, the 12 steps of the sun of Horus um, denotes the 12 hours of the day which then turned from Horus slight play on words into hours um, this is the, the, a different tangent to what's led me to to want to uh, you know back up what uh, um, happened on a hangout the other day we had uh, brother sovereign wordsmith reading from one of his uh, KJV um, chapter verses their gospels um, and I had to stop him and ask him to rewind what he just said because it was quite um, it was an, an analytical in my mind um, of, a, of a scenario where you would be standing 
in a judicial realm and um, getting delivered and so forth and names and claiming so um, stories interpretation so to the eight or ten hello to the ten viewers scribers as I like to call you is the Bible true or is it a story that's all I want answer me please true or story um, I need you to answer because I want to do a test if you're watching this video on a playback um, please answer me true or story um, and then afterwards you, we can go into um, what you think of that it's not my um, doing all I'm saying is the cognition of whom we are and um, what we are and how we are um, Josh X Santos Bonacci Jordan Maxwell Andy Sovereign Smith um, David and uh, you know Jeremita everybody that's scribing on the channel the Sun and Moon crew everybody we've had a chat with so far um, has led to this the uh, the supplementation of the hermeticism and the hermetic principles Thoth, Enki, um, Greek, Gods, Latin it's very interesting so um, let me see who's in the house what have we got story story Wilcar, no both um, okay story okay thank you it's a miracle if man walked on water and fed five thousand on five loaves into faith thank you the english language is spellcraft indeed it's a it's a, a, a construct is what the english language of uh, of late is yes uh, which you know there's different versions thou the art um i a y e i i captain um i itself e y e um, U Y O U E W E. Um, yes, Tommy. Um, we've uh, we we agree and thank you. Shut up, babbling, will you? From I of easy, my brother. As it happens, uh, we need to reinforce what's happening next week as well. Um, yes, uh, we will talk about that. Um, symbology. So um, yes, this is about my back in the day. I'm not promoting because it's closed down now. Crown circle wreath yeah globe in fact wreath of what how many leaves on it symbologies everywhere stories um we are given clues the karma the karmic retribution is um is outlaid somewhat by um by the proclamation of this establishment and force and um, construct and um, they somewhat divert um, the natural laws and the hermeticism the principles the seven principles um, the governance of faith and religion, very, very abstract and different. I'm sorry for what, I'm not sorry, but I am sorry for bringing um, at random some Jordan Maxwell to hit home at the point of um, this crux, you know, crucible moment here. Uh, it needs you to decide. Um, story, yes, it isn't called the, um, the greatest um, recollection of uh, articulate historical facts. It's called the Bible. We've looked at the words. We've gone through the alphabet. We've gone through the phonics. We've gone through the years, the uh, the interpretations, the messages, the subtext, um, Da Vinci, um, Constantine. Uh, yeah, so uh, then you have these emerald tablets. You have the 30 denominations of the Christian faith there. Um, when he, as Santos puts it, um, I do like the way he goes into actor mode. I'm not going to copy him, but I will emulate where he says there are two churches um, across the street from one another. You go into church um, X and you say hello there. Speak to the um, parishioner, pastor, clergyman, man of the cloth. And you, uh, you are told to uh, welcome into the house, the house of God. Um, their teachings are correct. There is the donation box. Put your money in there. Support this church. And all will be good. Um, Jesus will be coming through the clouds. <laughs> um, Santos's words, but we'll carry it on out of love and respect. Um, and uh, we wait for salvation and redemption through the, the second coming. Um, not to mention Jupiter and Mars and the um, the, the godlike connection of the celestial management of the astro theological connection of these churches, which has been overlaid with um, the New Testament and certain. Um, new uh, ways of praying and communicating then you go over from this church and you cross the road and you go over to this church and you ask if this church is the correct church 
and uh, will they deliver um, redemption, salvation, um, guidance, so forth. And uh, they will say, yes, yes, we are the number one. We are the ones that will be giving you that. Um, there is the donation box. If you'd like to go over, uh, put in your donation, support this church, then um, all will be well. So when you think there are 30,000 denominations of these churches, you'll be there some time and giving quite a lot of money in donations to try and find the answer. Now church, where does church come from? Church is an English word um, and uh, it is uh, comparable in the Scottish language to Kirk, K-I-R-K, -I, um, I believe. Kirk and church, church and Kirks. Um, uh, yes, and uh, before that we've got links to... Um, I can't think of the name, but somewhere in Greek, um, see, I'll get it you later. We are uh, having an etymological chat later, I believe, with um, Sun and Moon tonight, 9 p.m. Costa, myself, Josh X, and possibly another um, from 9 p.m. But um, I'll, I'll elaborate on all of the, the bits of this story later. But there are laws, okay? We are law masters, and um, we reside as privates self-governing sentient um tri parts under the uh, the main governance of yes in this ethereal temporal spiritual realm that is comprised of atoms and uh, universal laws that govern it once you work that out reality is but an illusion um the evidence that we've been given is quite um you know conflicting and i'm not trying to change anything here but uh, i would argue um, that this is a story well done for those that said story the greatest story ever told and you take from it and you interpret it and you use it and um, as for the messages and the ones that have spoken and started wars holding this book then that goes to show you their interpretations and their uh, meanings behind that we have reference to the symbology and the um, the construct and the way that it is then um, it appears that you need 40 years in the wilderness to uh, get this and if you are here scribing and you're taking note and you're finding relevance and pennies are dropping into place and um, you are now having a sharp contrast with what you thought and now where you are and going forward what will be with words like manifest and manuscript <laughs> it's very very interesting and um, financially um, the establishment wins always you will see in the news that the uh, financial services and sectors of the United Kingdom have uh, outlined that they have moved 10% of their assets um, out of the United Kingdom. So with regards to what's happening with the backstop and um, the, uh, the, the chaos that's about to ensue with the um, impending recession and slowdown of economical and market sociological growth here in the land of England and Wales, aka the United Kingdom's um, construct and overlay, um, we are not uh, we are not looking too strong and um, should you need guidance on uh, you know going forward with that uh, I find it uh, you know quite hilarious as to what's happening in the uh, the, the games that are afoot here so um, it's uh, it's truly incredible that we put so much faith in the system that we all complain about we all moan about we know that it's broken we say that we could do a better job but yet we are here again trying to patch a leaky hole with the system um, processes implementations policies of the united kingdom and um, the trade union deal and um, these financial services which is london essentially we've explained about london the mayor of london and um, the uh, you know the Lord Mayor of London, the Crown, the Kronos, um, the Christos. Um, wow, yeah, it's really coming full circle for G Star, me, Andy, um, Kevin, you, um, Josh, um, with his new language interpretation and further cementation of the ionization and zions and stuff. Uh, these financial markets are based on fractionalized reserve banking. And when we have a, a, a consortium of seven private um, financiers um, lending to our government with the, with the system at hand that we have, and they are all moving their 10% of assets out of the United Kingdom, they only base it on 10% with the fractional reserve banking system. So we see that they see, and they are moving, there is shutdowns and car manufacturers um, you know, uh, talking about what's happening. There's a lot of speculative um, commercial 
and fear but what we don't want you to do is fear or worry and those of you that have bought gold well done um, that's something that will not be manipulated as easy as paper um, you know uh, we've looked at the gold and what happened with the gold and the prices intrinsic value um, yeah it can be um, looked after and hoarded and it is like an insurance policy to most there for those reasons any valuable um, you know uh, metal is um, there are ways of asset protection and asset management and now more so than ever man is running around wondering how and when and why and where and um, there are trillions of dollars being made trillions of pounds euro dollars petrol dollars there are ex, um, ex uh, um, officers of the uh, military here the united kingdom's military secretaries generals ex um, prime ministers doing speeches at 220 250 pound uh, 250,000 pounds um, to speak rubbish to the people and they are looking after the commerce and the markets no one's looking after the man and the body the flesh the common law the rights um, it's all about market commerce persons trade deals backstop um, wow yes it's it's quite farcical so um, I've explained and had a chat with the team and said that this gravitas at the minute of this renaissance of where we are at um, and the coincidence with various um, dates, times, um, you know, political manoeuvres and wars, foreign war policy, um, what's happening on, the, on, a, on, a, on a, you know, the machine itself is very busy in all areas and we thank you for all the input um, and direction and support that we're getting so far. Um, I will outlay Veda.com and, and some more videos tonight and this week more information that you need. I will catch up with uh, the rest of the emails, notifications and thank you all for your input, your care, your um, you know questions and comments will all be dealt with. I'm off um, out of servitude for a couple of days. Next week I'm on holiday um, and if you can call it that working holiday um, we'll be in Wales. I am making a trip in Wales to see Adele and three ladies that tell me they have um, some uh, some uh, some need for information with regards to um, uh, assets that are at a special needs academy and um, they are meeting resistance and trouble from the academy the uh, principal um, head head of years and so forth so um, possibly this year we'll look for an expansion and um, promotions networking and um, the continuation with the trust technology, um, express private express trusts, um, lawful, legal, um, under England and Wales, expansion of the implementation of the instrumentation and um, continuing the story and the review um, of the information at hand. It is not for one man to tell, it takes the family, it is very very massive it's been going on a long time it's written in the uh, in the subtext of your reality and um, we have quite a lot of substance over form um, not just remedies in law remedies in life remedies with science remedies with technology remedies with history um, your health your well-being your structure there is um, there is a fundamental principle to all of life's problems and um, these great uh, men that I have followed, such as, um, we'll start with um, Santos and the uh, Australian side, Romley Stewart, Max uh, Egan and his chats there, Franco Collins, that's the Australian men that I've um, paid homage to, Sadhguru and um, lots of uh, names that I cannot pronounce correctly from India um, and the, uh, the East there, 40 years in the wilderness in the East getting educated, America, too many to mention, um, but of late, um, Stowe Villa was a pure joy, delight to come across, um, lifting the veil all my days, um, wow, that just, that's just blown my mind again, and um, yeah, going over to see the Able Danger Field family, um, what's happening there with what Andy's done with the uh, expansion of um, his view, application, experience, and um, you know uh, the book and um, his historical outline interpretation of things up to press 2019 allegedly the year of our lord um, and then we've got the technology that come from um, initially facebook kenneth was king uh, richard ansar um, the, uh, the 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 trust the foundation of the triangle um, grand tour uh, english anglo uh, united kingdom set law americorps 
um, American and uh, yes we have the uh, we have the outlay of the true technologies that are fundamentally governing the United Kingdom the legal the canons the ecclesiastical the UCC the Admiralty um, discharge charges and um, you know it's uh, the judicial realm status standing and capacity the legalese the you know we've come a long way we're in a strong place but we're not quite home free um, the uh, the outline of uh, of what you and what you are and who you are is down to your interpretation we are not here to tell you we are not here to uh, make the decisions for you we are here to let you know where we are why we see it um, what we believe in now and um, belief systems um, to some extent, 90% of what we are all believing is based on the establishment systems. Now, my aim um, and yours and the family and SPLsPro.com's discovery has found that most of these systems are based on um, theses and um, principal ideas. Um, as we always go to Darwin's theory, um, technology, um, electricity, um, magneto-electro, zero point, quantum and um, vortex math to name a few i can't talk about these uh, you know competently because i'm not qualified in the university but i am qualified with 40 years in the school of life traveling in the east between the two pillars um k9 k being 11 of the alphabet and nine um just madness that's going on we are currently again um remashing another subtext with the babble phonics numbers gematria and um, we're in a really strong excellent place there's a lot of demand a lot of expectation so these next 48 hours um i'm going to be on quite a lot of um, emails updates um i won't be publicly available but i will be tending to private um, issues appointments and uh, behind the scenes g star we need to do four updates and look at an email um, campaign Barnsley I will be in touch with you sister Nonna I believe you're all right dot com issues there isn't any as far as I know um, comments from scribers let's see what we're saying who we got in the house take a breath that's your update fam sorry it's been a while we have um, we have a, a result from the landlord situation I'll give you an update on as well so before I go to your comments um, uh, an assured short hold tenancy AST what um, what the Queen had here is um, is basically governed governed um, for notice of quit by UK legislation anybody that has a business here in the UK is uh, running it under the UK laws legislation and practices so all I did was go to the government pages and advice for landlords and check the government's advice for landlords giving notice to quit with a, a tenancy type that suited the one the agreement that uh, Queenie here had with um, landlord and uh, lo and behold it says you need to give um, eight weeks notice you have to give legal notice there were certain parameters to fulfill um, long story short um, I wasn't obliged to uh, furnish the landlord with the correct legal proceedings under UK legislation for landlords and tenants um, other governance comes into play when there are um, assets in the uh, in the residential um, property that would be under the legal age and um, therefore are classed as such and extra consideration should be given when giving notice to ladies and um, ladies with uh, um, assets of uh, daughters sons under um, 16 18 um, considered vulnerable um, these mitigating circumstances um, would be beneficial to you to know not necessarily for Anna Maria the Queen right now but if you are a landlord or you are in that property management then please don't try and give anybody 21 days notice equivalent of three seven day weeks to vacate pack register find and move out it's just crazy so we have now some good news where I've furnished the landlord with extra information, no aggression, no vexation, no malice, no playing no games, no phone calls, no nasty texts, just simple professional emails of uh, correspondence outlining the facts, the dangers um, of breaches of and uh, management. And uh, thank you for Brother Kev for uh, me letting you use your email and copy you in for, as a witness there to the proceedings and um, it's been sorted out privately so um, it just goes to show you when you first get faced 
with a nightmare, impossible, hostile um, situation, which is the end of uh, end of things as you know it, and causing significant concern, anxiety, um, breaches of um, can be enforced quite simply. A couple of emails, a um, few sentences, um, being going the extra mile and politely lets them know that you know the game. And if they're in the game of business management, lettings, property management, estate management, so forth and so on, then, uh, you know, you are governed um, by rights. And if you don't pay, then they can come for you. And if they don't do certain things, then you can go for them. It, the law is a two way street. It's not just about the system coming for us. And it's just surprising what one can effect with a few polite, but structured, well-structured sentences and coming from a different angle, removing the anger um, and the hostility, taking the upper ground, um, turning the other cheek. And for me, it's quite an accomplishment. Um, yeah, I'm proud of that. And I'm proud for Queenie to get a, res you know, a resolution with the deposit has been returned before she actually leaves to give her um, extra help to get a property. And um, that leads me on to um, property at the minute, 600 per calendar month in the Midlands, East Midlands area. It shows you that this market is manipulated and it's controlled. House prices, equity, interest, the Bank of England, back to the seven elite bankers running around in cahoots with the Kronos, the crown of all time. And uh, we are seeing a fixed market, property management. Um, don't, you know, we're going to cover common hold tenancies, leasehold, assured tenancies, um, different types of leases, holds. Um, which ones are beneficial, which ones aren't, why they do this, how they do it, how they increase um, land rent, the stamp duty. Um, if you was to look at a mortgage and, uh, you know, these uh, these uh, um, annexes to the uh, lodial titles in 1913 via, um, via deeds and... Um, and bonding is uh, is something quite tricky if you look at the 1882 bills of exchange and you look through the historical um content going backwards you can see um you know th there was quite a lot done um in the 1800s and it looks quite good um honest and then the 1900s 1913 1950 1970 1980 1990 2000 and it's got faster and faster and faster and what they've slowly done um, obviously we've got more history we've got thousands to give you but we have got an articular timeline of the last say 2000 years very good the last 500 years you'd be amazed in what's happened with the bills the statutes the acts the constitution let alone the uh, armadas invasions battles and the lineages with the history and the management of the tribal and the annihilation of um, with the colonization we'll call it the colonial wars um, very very dark so again it's not uh, our pleasure to bring you this but uh, it's there it's all there for you I got that I got that <sighs> story of events yes Lindsay well done P9 hello all mythology holds truths yes well this is not a myth this is a story the greatest story you know how many original copies um, of the book um are around and how many uh, it's been translated in um old testament new testament um very very key um cornerstone from santos uh, no from uh, from jordan and the pyramid and the cornerstone and the chief cornerstone and such things as um messiah and uh, yeah very very uh, well done don't watch the news john it's bad for you rose tinted easy fpv and his uh, Aha. Uh -huh. What a revelation. Indeed it is, brother. Indeed it is. And especially thanks to your work, your words, what you've been doing, chapter and verse coming from Jordan Maxwell. I have the ninth edition, Oxford Dictionary, BCA, what he talks about. Yes, John. Thank you for that. And thank you for sharing that. This is all information that, uh, as we've said, uh, needs to be out there. It's not to be covered, Sid. Looks. Mia Christus, glad tidings, thank you for that, smiley face, hearts, the world, my coffee, my goodness, put you back here, it's a better position, so much hidden in this story through, 
to me is a form of controlling and conditioning one way yes yes agreed mike our church is between our temple mm, the pillars indeedy you go there every day church and gov hijack science and technology to hide the construct yes they have f indeed they have and what a magnificent construct it appears to be turning out to be I would say that now I know about <clears throat> the, uh, <clears throat> well, I say that clear my throat here. Quantum, atomical, magneto, electro, and everything else. I seem to be stood on the floor. But the floor is actually a void. Everywhere around us would be a void. So, in fact, the realm, plane, globe is, a, is, a, is another expansion, extension of a, of, a, of a reality which may be not as it seems and when you go deeper into it it's like your brain allows you to see a little bit more when you start thinking about so if all atoms are hollow and i'm stood on atoms now then theoretically i'm stood in a void it's just uh yeah food for thought church though kirk kirk starship enterprise ucc codes seas space data you know what I mean? Interesting. Cogs turning. Circes, that's the one, Tommy. Circes, thank you for that. The Greek goddess who lures you into her home, then feeds you fat, and then eats you. Church, Kirk, going back to Circes. That's what he called. Excellent. Thank you very, very much, Brother Tommy. In Ewok, Lev. See you later, Mike. Nice one for the link F. Legal has to be seen to be true. Indeed, John. Thank you for your diligence with enlightening my grey matter. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you. Thank you for uh, scribing and uh, taking the time out from uh, the programming, the usual programming. Here's good news on the tenancy. Yes, it's, uh, it's there. Um, all you got to do is apply your due diligence and um, remain calm and know that all will be well half of the battle with life's problems are your mental attitude they're designed to hit you in such a way that it makes you go <gasps> shock fear you know um i feel the need for a jumper uh, um colors boxes um big letters capitalizations um you know and the way that they are telephone calls strict stern agents demanding wanting payment um, using the force of law the words that they use and how they use them are designed mentally you know we've talked about this before <coughs> um, the mental cogn cog um, cognizance that we have the dissonance and so forth it's uh, it's done for a reason it's done to uh, to put you like that it's not nice it's not clever we don't speak like that so tenancy, yeah, we've just enforced the rights and used the .gov.uk using, as is often the case, a simple um, remedy where we use their own rules against them. And if there's anything extra that you can put on for vulnerability, mitigating um, certain things like that, then all the merrier. And if you don't know to use it, then it won't be used. And if you don't know that you can't be sent a tenancy quit notice via a text message, I guarantee there will be at least 100,000 private tenants that will have had a tenancy ended via a text or an email. Now, if you accept that and you allow that and you authorise that and you respond and you take the call, you take the email, you write, you start swearing, you get angry and it all escalates, 20 emails and three days later... You have got full knowledge that you're going to be that you're going to be moving out. The landlord wants you out, wherever it be for arrears, or they want to sell, or um, it's end of the agreement, and therefore they uh, you know they, they happen to want to get somebody else in. They might be putting up the rent. They might want to do property maintenance and development extension. So there's a varied host of reasons why um, legally you would have the agreement end. An agreement is not really legal because it's a construct and we've gone through all of this, I'm at ease. So that's really a private agreement, um, not in a court um, between a private landlord, a property owner, um, a private sovereign self-governing queen there who's um, going to commit trade levy and barter privately, not in the public, but using this man and his uh, publicly listed business in a private capacity. Ah, I know, sorry. So, uh, yeah, it's just truly incredible that others 
and we'll be out there <clears throat> and we're sorry for this but this is why we are here and we do what we do because you will have been served in a non-legal way but accepted it and then created a whole host of pain for yourselves which is unfortunate and it's due to ignorance and the education and the doctrines of which you are accustomed to and not the correct ones but now we can outline simply this education this passive learning for free and reservation of your rights and um, as soon as you start answering and responding and confirming and even in anger or even not in anger and arguing it you've responded and let them know via the text reply the email reply and then that gives them confirmation so then they can now in their mind move forward legally which notice has been given cheaply uh, illegally unlawfully ineffectively but still been done so while ever these these like um, property managers with a few grand and you know maybe some money that the uh, father's family and um, they've got lucky and um, maybe they are working for somebody else and masquerading thinking they are the uh, the big man you know making out to the tenants that they're the man and really there's several investors behind them very mixed up this business world but you have tenancy rights landlord rights legal rights lawful rights unalienable rights yeah there's five already yeah so a text message doesn't cut it an email doesn't cut it and um, there is parameters and governance out there for you to call upon to quickly, effectively and concisely lock it down, remove the anxiety, remove the anger, all of the confusion and discharge it um, to get the deposit back and to get into this state and um, get it resolved is a win. It's a quick win and it was uh, a legal win. So that's um, where the legal section gets you when you argue from the land in the private using your instrumentation and your instrumentation calling upon the legal so you see the man the well man man on land private trader self-governing implements instrumentation to go into the commerce and the commerce cannot come into the private this is where you've got all the trade as it would be so that's where the governance and the line think of it as a border you're over that and there's that and sometimes that that border gets merged so uh that helps anybody clarifies anything quick it's not legal advice at all it's just business conduct we would call it ethics morality duties got to be recognized not asking for anything above and beyond not thinking you're anybody extra equality is paramount and um, you know those that want to um, reside in equitable remedies then that's all very well and good but sometimes we don't need to involve that you know use it where we use the common laws and that common law legal system has come to a good resolution quickly and effectively without making a big stink and uh, you know going elsewhere so um it just goes to show you yeah and thank you diligence that's the key Not all storms are here to destroy, Dave. Some sweep the path clear. Yes, they do. The Indian gods, um, Vishnu, Brahma, and somebody else, is it? Dharma, Vishnu, Brahma, I forget now. Indeed, creation. Tommy, roasting it. Nearly lost my children's equity in the house, thanks to them. Oh, moving on. Sorry, John. MG. Frank, big like, easy now, new scriber. Thank you, Frank. Written notice only, yes. And what does that written notice have to contain? Maybe a signature as well for the uh, public private liabilities. Agreed, Tommy. Shivai, hey, Shiva, boom, boom, all is atom, atom, Adam, Adama. Um, much to bring out on that and the phonics and the. Um, yeah, just really is massive. I am going to read the Rig Vedas and the Vedas um, East, spending more time in the East, getting the uh, the education, a more rounded education. Um, I was up to 3 a.m. today reading stupid publications and documents and whatnot. So um, 48 hours and we will be uh, addressing messages, emails, updates. I'm having some time out. And um, that's the luxury of being um, in the you know non-commercial area with uh, self-employment, not going into the corporation. You don't get holiday pay. You don't get assurances. You don't get all of the perks of the you know uh, commercial slave realm. 
being in trade and being in private has many benefits as we are finding out it's not all about being in the public and um, you know we're operating as we've been previously told informed instructed advised um, by, by by our uh, peers family friends thank you very much so that's a good update we are live at nine myself josh a man called come on it's greek costa i believe sun and moon channel um, um etymological um and phonical references let me remind you we are all phoenicians you are using phonics every day so you know we are all allegedly international bankers using international instruments and federal reserve notes and bank notes you know so we are all classified and assumed as a lot of things um now you need to know whom and what you are once we've outlined that um in accordance and you know with current um i don't know what you'd call it now um amalgamations of the technologies, the laws, the uh, languages, the instruments. Um, it's very, very uh, you know, interesting as a DJ, being um, the man that made the party and had the records, now going to the public for the records and becoming a party, David and Jeremita. So um, plays on words, situation, style, status, capacities. Um, <clears throat> fantastic, really is. And um, this educational learning path has been brought to you by me and it's been brought to me by um, the family, the trust technologies, Smithy, all of the SPLs, previous admins, family, ones, sisters and brothers that were there. This last four years now, we're into year four um, since the trust um, technology has been two years since uh, going on Facebook and pushing into it hard via YouTube has been four years in total and um, 40 years in the wilderness. You can't argue that man was learning from zero. Yes, you can. You are learning as soon as you come out. You are picking stuff up. You're in contact with the, uh, you know, the, the matrix. And um, we've got a lot to discover still, a lot to point out. Um, more updates, um, ideas with Josh, um, Andy, a book, publications, Wales, um, coming this week. It is only Tuesday at 3 p.m. Um, and, um, I'm going down with Andy, we will be down there. I don't know for how long, I can't speak for Andy, I can only speak for myself. I envisage um, two days, something like that, um, and we will get more updates. I suggest you go to the Able Danger, Field McConnell, Gobsmack Avenues, it's their event, they're the ones that have invited myself as a guest um, live on that stream. So um, it's casual, laid back, informative, if we need to speak, we can speak. You know, we don't have scripts. It comes from here. It comes from here. There's some of it, a little bit. <laughs> and it comes from here. These three is where it is, as with everything, the Trinity. So, um, yeah, I'm humbled, honoured, privileged to um, for what may um, happen, transpire. Um, we will give some speeches, interviews, talks, um, networking. Uh, if I'm allowed to record and go live and show you, then by all means I will. Um, remember, it's private um, to some extent there, um, publicly, uh, you know, put out. So we will see. Um, this year is going to be a big year. The dot com is growing exponentially, and the documents and videos have been updated. I suggest if you are on the dot com, you go back and have a look at the updates and news feed. Um, the padlock is there all the time. We've um, sorted out. A little issue we had with avatars um yeah bear with us i'm not a website master engineer as with the trust technologies we're learning and cognizing to do uh, many and various things as fast and as accurately as we can and um, we are um, only human after all you know don't put the blame on me well <laughs> you could argue that i'm I'm, uh, I'm asking you to put the blame on me and um, we are trying to do the best we can with the tools that we've got now we're building extra tools um, I've got to sort out Patreon, um, the videos on YouTube and playlists have been updated, yeah, the documents, um, the structure, the continuous improvement, messaging facility, um, yeah, looking forward to meeting a lot of Americans, standing proud to, by the side of Smithy, we've been on an excellent journey so far, truly um, honourable man, um, one of the most honourable, um, loving and uh, clever um, smart arsed wordsmiths mother I've ever seen so um, yeah it's uh, it's it, it is what it is and we go with the flow um, if you make plans they can only go wrong 
the numbers they speak to me as you know um, the substance over the form and um, yeah we'll uh, we'll do a bit of research for tonight I'll get prepared I'll put the links on the dot com and about the places so watch out for Sun and Moon um, Sister Karen Patricia Flat Earth um, hopefully we'll be there Flat Earth Dude um, myself Costa Josh and I think another um, you'll find the video and the uh, trailer on there um, it's very key um, now that we uh, we start the uh, repetition of it's boring for us and we've done it hundreds of times which is why we can just quickly get there and, and remember now but um, we've all been there we've all got to start somewhere if you are um, in a bad way financially uh, spiritually and um, physically um overall um mentally um and these other these there's many and various things we can provide but we're only able to provide that through the law system that we've found that has been coveted through the thirty thousand um and so this is only christian um denominations of that church of that kirk and then you've got the different religions and the faiths and everybody seems to be really focused on the United Kingdom and the Labour Party's anti-Semitic remarks. Well, Semiticism aside, there's a whole bigger ball game here. Um, America's building a wall. Um, England, the United Kingdom, sorry, uh, is having the Brexit. The European are holding us by whatever. Everything's collapsing. Nobody really knows much. We've got an identity and language crisis going off and we are trying to cognize in all of this tornado of chaos as much as the relevant key you know information you need and why we see it the way we do how we act how we now um, proceed with this crazy um matrix of you know carpet bombed by um by notices is what's happening we have a war going off and we are all being carpet bombed by ai notices and um the greatest story never told is going to be told to you through um, this untelevised revolution of YouTube. Unfortunately, though, doing it on this platform and media gives them everything that we know that we need to give to you. So it outlines, you know, a good um, stalemate position. Um, anybody um, that's out there that wants to, uh, you know, proceed with life in honour with clean hands needs this. And it's, uh, it's our pleasure. No answers as such. No advice. Not an expert in anything. I know nothing in the grand scheme of things. And very humbled. Um, the Sumerian story is not a story. There is artifacts and uh, there is inscriptions and tablets. And I love it. That is my area. Babylon, Assyria, Arkad, Mesopotamia, the Battle of Gilgamesh, Anunnaki, Nephilim. Ah, oh, yes. That is the... In uh, India, Iraq... Um, the uh, peninsula, um, the atomic uh, issues there with the scarring of the Arabian Peninsula and um, the tablets, Thoth, it's very, very interesting. Egypt is a Greek word given to Egypt. Egypt is Greek. I'm going to mention this to Costa tonight. Um, Kemet, alchemical, Chem, Egypt, chemicals, alchemical, um, cornerstone. It's just massive. Um, just get them. This is off top of my head. What do I think about that? So, um Thank you to that, Frank. Um, Sumerian story is more than a story. It's more provable than the Bible and um, the information that we can correlate to times, lineages, centuries, monarchs, Rome, Egyptians, Babylonian, Arkad. This is what I mean when indigos get in there and we go in. We go in deep, um, light workers, crystals, rainbows, you guys, yourselves, your various channel and uh, all of the speakers, Alan Watts, I didn't mention, Napoleon Hill, two other prolific speakers, Jack Fresco, Nikola Tesla, RIP, great legendary men, souls, um, more other than that, but uh, yeah, that's it for your update, hopefully we'll see you on um, Button Moon, Sun and Moon tonight, with the aforementioned brothers, I think they're all men, um, I expect a reply, update, notification from me, um, with regards to what we've done over the last few weeks, I will do this and I will get up to date. We don't have PAs, systems, offices. We're in servitude, as you can see, so we're balancing everything. Please be patient. And um, We're not available for consultations, myself or Andy, until the end of April to Brother, um, to brother uh, Anonymous. 
I'll keep it private. So some of the donations come for consultations for basically reserving some of our private time for a chat. That's what a consultation is. And when we say no advice can be given, no legal advice, um, sale on tea can be given. We have um, a finite amount of time on this realm and we would give um, information in a private um, consultation based scenario, um, you know, trade private, and that's what the 15 donation is. I would take some of that as remuneration, and the trust pot would take some a percentage, and it builds up. So, the more we could get agents working for SPOs Pro, would build up the community chest, the monopoly of what we're all in. I can't stop speaking, it's just coming out. Practicing for tonight, though, we'll keep rolling. Monopoly, do not pass, go. Um, go to jail, collect two hundred. do not collect £200. Well, what we're saying is, um, we're turning the crown upside down, so the spiky bit at the top goes to the bottom, and we create a level playing field. And on top of there, yes, um, Monopoly is not going to have, um, you know, such a monopoly on our structure, systems, banking, debt, finance, outlook, lineage, academies, health, trusts, science, education, welfare, foreign war policy, cancer. Um, we're going to start telling them how to do it because if we sit back any longer and watch this facade continue, um, so help me God, I will not be responsible for my following vocal outbursts to all of those in the in the ministerial and non-ministerial praying look for you, for them, uh, ministerial and non-ministerial positions. So um, against the religion, money, war, language, uh, we will expose it as best as we can. So um, that was just a little add on that uh, rolled on from um, <laughs> extra bits that are going to get mentioned tonight. Assess, adapt and overcome in your favour. I like that. I do like that. De facto. Loving your lie. Being away from internet for a while. Nice to see you now. I'm back online. Thank you. Love Alan Watts. Oh, free woman. Excellent. Thank you very much. New scriber. Lots of love to you, my sister. We'll say namaste. We salute the spirit from within to you. Indigo skies. Nice name. You want to notice you live? Hope you will. Thank you. You will need to rewind to get the full um, update on that. Yes, Frank. Love Indigo. Oh, well, you know each other. Thank you, free woman. It's the only way to go. It's based on coffee, too much of it, and um, yeah, caffeine and the love, the passion. <clears throat> I was created energetic. I didn't know why. I thought it was so I could stay up all night and um, mash up underground bass line um, and rave acid house classics piano classics and entertain the masses i was after david getta i've turned into david da vinci painting and uh, decorating uh, and now um david um king david we are all as king so uh, getta to da vinci to king queen um all equal created in the eyes um, with the essence of so thank you much love um i don't know how we handle all these topics and um articulately get it, it to you but uh, it happens it happens for a reason others are sent to help us um i am going to look at the raconteurs um the uh the yorkshire um subscriber that said check out um off the grid i've got a lot of notifications and things to address and emails they will be done and um, we're going to move forward and um, looking forward to next week and um, i'll give you all the information i've got um, it's nice to see messages on the dot com i've told andy <laughs> and he's aware and he's going to have a check um, mans are buying tickets from countries booking nights in hotels to come and meet and greet and network and um, when you read something like that it does really hit home i am prepared um, to say what we feel and do and how we are and give out everything that we can um direct to the dot com um as for the, the educational going forward the trust master trust servant principal we have got plans for um, online seminars and um, courses and quizzes tests um, expansion of the declarations treaties um england and wales versus the united kingdom you get me so um this is very key, uh, in, in competent importance here. Um, wordplay and fun aside, um, it's very serious. 
It involves you and your life and your rights and your belief. And, um, you know, there's a lot of scary men out there think they have power. Um, it needs correcting. There is a way to do it. And you don't need to go and shout. You don't need to dress up in a black uniform. You don't need a stun gun. You don't need mace spray. You don't need an army of legal barristers or anything like that. Um, it can be given to you. You are all um, stars, gifts in the present, super duper um, reflections of and um, made of stardust so that's all i can say i thank you i love you all of the brothers and sisters out there being patient extra thanks to you um we are going to push this forward um land acquisition management um appointments at chancery we're on the cusp of it um getting down to see some others that have been waiting to be um having a visit or a chat we'll look at that uh, mackenzie friend uh, accompaniment to the uh, the judicial realm is not really a desire because we advocate not to go there paperwork should precede man but um, if there is issues and um, the brown stuff's hitting the fan um, we've got a lot to contemplate this year and um, when i do get bored we've always got this to read look <laughs> we're going to make our own publications as uh, smithy is showing you there and um, there's a demand a want a need there are hundreds and hundreds of billions on this realm um, hundreds of billions no seven billion so many million hundreds of millions and uh, yeah there is a, there's a lot we can do together there's more that connects us than divides us and separates us and um, yeah we we, we, we will uh, you know update you and get in touch if you've offered we will accept and we will um, we will structure it um, going over to April um, I have got some time for and the Queen's um, father's um, funeral is in April um, the mid-April, and then, um, yeah, we've got Wales March, um, funeral April, so after that, uh, May, back on, maybe summertime, we'll look for land um, on England and Wales, please, for a seminar, I believe I've got, I've had a, an answer from Brother Tom for Oxford, and that was a, no, the land has uh, changed, um, we need, um, we need to look at um, a possible outdoor seminar, um, another annual conference, second conference for SPLs, um, if you've got any ideas, land, um, establishment, where we can put RVs, campers, have fires, cook, you know, things like that, private, land, no public, then um, please let me know. That'll do. Thank you very much. Shadow, uh, nice to see you. Dave Paul is right, brother, I agree. Yeah, we'll talk about breathing, we'll do that meditation, abdomen, pushing out, in and out, oxygen levels, and um, yeah. Easy, Jermaine, indigo skies. Oh, is it? Hello there, sister. Everyone needs to get the book of law and nations, the answers are in plain sight. It's all right, Shadow, thank you for that. Sounded awesome, thank you, Tommy. That's it then, we're done, that's it, all good. Ciao Bello, stay sovereign, 25 viewing, 12 thumbs, give us a thumb, give us a share, if you care, and um, I'll uh, be back on later with Sun and Moon um, updates throughout the week, exclusive ones for the dot .com, coming from SPLs Pro, unlisted, um, that's how we're rolling now, we give you everything we need to in the public, then we're having private chats um, as much as we can do, until we work out um more systems going forward so ciao bello peace and love that was a swift hour wasn't it that's what you call the power hour um in equivalent to the woman's hour that was brought to you by the sovereign man david okay here in england and wales the sovereign hour one day we'll have more publications won't we smithy hey hey what's happening here i just can't adam and eve it i don't believe my mince pies <laughs> Peace and love. Thank you very much. I am not worthy. We are not worthy.